Okay, so the first puppet that I need to be looking for is actually somewhere in the Tower of Wisdom. So I gotta go start wandering and hope I find something. And it, it works out because then I could start grinding Terra and quick spawn a little bit more. Because, again, I need them at least to level 30 to find them, I believe. Or at least, you know, complete their side quests. It's kind of weird. Certain ones you have to do an actual, like, side quest for, and others you just have to grind. It's kind of weird that way. Oh, I didn't know you floated. To be fair, I've never actually collected Quicksilver. Or a quick spawn, I should say. He is one of the ones that kind of eluded me the first time I played through. But he looks freaking badass. Look at him. He's just floating there. He's all cool looking. So I missed a chest. A cat's paw. Actually, no, it's probably a good idea to put something on you guys anyway, because some of you are very, much, like, not protected. Oh, yeah, let me just equip you as well, because you're awesome. There we go. Just something to put on you. I am up so high! Is there something over to this area that I need to worry about? Because I don't remember ever being up here before. Uh, that's a new one. That is a very new one. Okay, after much wandering and much confusion, I have found him. Hello. Who are you? Who disturbs my eternal slumber? Ustaki's descendant? Yes, actually. Then die. Alright, we gotta fight this guy first. It's kind of one of those prove your worth kind of situations. Alright. In that case, a little closer. Hmm. Okay, I can't do much to you, so I'll leave you for now. But Terra, you could probably do some damage. Alright, Dark Knight, I guess we'll test your worth. What can you do? You could also do this stuff. Let's see how you do. There we go! Easy peasy. I am defeated. You are indeed Mustak is incessant. I shall forget the past. Yes, I do want you to join my party. Come on, buddy! Alright. But yeah, funnily enough here, this particular puppet... There's... Much like with the, um, the Egg Brothers, there is three in total. They're all scattered about in different towers, and you have to fight them and recruit them. What we could do with them will be decided much later, obviously, because, um, funnily enough, their particular side quest doesn't come till after we get all the items. We get all the, uh, stones. So, if I recall, the next one should be in the Tower of Nine Tails. I'm going to quickly heal first because uh, Charte is 
completely low on items now. Or at least completely low on MP at the moment. But yeah, if we take a look at our buddy here, Duke. I believe that's what his name was. Oh, status. Let's see here. Duke, yep. He is a water-based one. He is more close range. Obviously, he's only level one, so we gotta buff him up a little bit. I think we'll switch him out for Charte at the moment. Because she's pretty frickin' strong right now. And I need to level up her sister more anyway. But... There should be another one, another one in the uh, Tower of Ninetales. The, and then I believe there's another one in another temple, which we can't get to just yet anyway, because we have to actually unlock that area. But we're, we're moving along pretty good, considering. Alright, so I got Terra up now to level 30. So, we'll see how this goes. Let's see if I get a cutscene or not. No. Okay. Maybe it's 35, then. I could've sworn it was 30, but it could be 35. Either way, I'm getting her up pretty fast, and I'm leveling up the other characters pretty fast, too. If I can find more of those slimes, they seem to really rack up the experience points once I find those. But yeah, as in case you can tell, I'm still looking for Duke's brother, as it were. We'll get there eventually. But uh, for now, we're still taking out griffins and wandering through this tower and hoping to find what we need. Alright, let's see if 35 does the trick. No, okay. Good to know. Okay, it took me a bit of wandering about, but I did find him. Yes, I, I am friend. I am offspring of Spustake. No, your buddy Duke is with me, right? You don't have to fight, right? Okay. Well, in that case, uh, here, have some pancakes. <laughs> yes, I am an amazing descendant. I am a, quite a fighter. Yes, join my party. Well, that's two now we've taken care of. <laughs> the third one... I cannot get to until I start the quest to get the, um... The third... Or that's the final stone, at the very least. So, with that out of the way... Come on, where's my... There it is. So the next area we will be going to... Let me just head over to Blue Cat anyway, because that will be important. Very, very shortly. Let me switch party members here, because uh, we're going to need to level Chiba up a little bit. And I have to re-look at my thing, because I could have sworn that getting Terra and Sharte up to level 30, 30 or 35 was the key, but I guess there is more I need to worry about. But, uh, nonetheless, we have that taken care of. So, pretty much uh, the majority of the rest of the um, puppets I gotta worry about involve leveling, because I already took care of the eggs, I took care of Koro, I took care of Elkun, I took care of Flair, uh, Charte and Terra, I still need to level up, Duke and Chiba and the other one that I'm missing, that will come later, as will Legem. And I believe there are, let's see if I recall, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12... Yeah, there is at least four more puppets we need to obtain. So. 
If we get the one from the one tower, we have three others to worry about. Hmm. Well, I guess we will touch upon those uh, in another episode. This was kind of more the side quest section of the game. I wanted to get those done before I actually started advancing more with the plot. This was kind of cool. I haven't seen a lot of these other particular characters yet, so this was an interesting little adventure. But we'll uh, we'll actually get back to the main plot line very very soon. But for now, this is Star Princess HLC saying thank you very much for watching and have a fond farewell.